Saxton, stand up and show respect to the show off. Not good sitting. I like this tag team. Ziggler's always had the in-ring skills and the big mouth, but now he's got a Scottish psychopath to back it up. The following contest is a fatal four-way tag team ladder match and is for the SmackDown Tag Team Championship. Ziggler and Introducing first at a combined weight Monday Night of 472 pounds, Drew McIntyre These two Dolph gentlemen call their shots and deliver in a big way. Well, one of the ways they delivered, Corey, was when they targeted the Shield and in the process also won the Raw Tag Team titles. Talking about the Shield, you talk about Dolph Ziggler dethroning Seth Rollins for the Intercontinental Championship. Drew McIntyre has his eyes firmly fixed on the Universal Championship. You are looking at the future of the business. One night after another, these two gentlemen call their shots and deliver and in a big first. way. Well, and a combined weight of 468 pounds. The shield and and Benjamin. Benjamin. The SmackDown Tag Team titles will be on the line in mere moments. I've been waiting for this one, Michael. These teams are sure to pull out all the stops and put on a show. A true superstar inside the ring and out. <laughs> a fellow and Gator from Live Oak, Florida, weighing in at 270 pounds, Titus O'Neill. I have to admit, Corey, he's a great manager, competitor, and even a philanthropist. Listen, Titus is as smart as they come, but he's also twice as strong as anybody you've probably ever met. I mean, he's unbelievably talented in the ring. Really gives the University of Florida a, a really good name, unlike others. He's talking about you, Saxton. I know subtlety's not something they teach at the U of M. Yeah, I get it. is here. And from Benway State, Nigeria, weighing in at 241 pounds, Apollo Crews. Made a return to NXT, joined the main event scene there, and is doing the best work of his career. Always had the athleticism, but now he has a drive like never before. for Cruz to execute on his vision. Well, I just hope he can do that without bleeding from his eyes. Here comes Master Gable. And representing the Alpha Academy from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable. Chad Gable is a gold medalist who went to the next level as a member of the Alpha Academy. 
Chad Gable always competes at the highest level, both mentally and physically. Oh, Saxton, stop sucking up. Gable will never uh, thank you. Two decades of experience. He's been a champion everywhere. A champion who lives the best life. Jet setting all over the globe. The sky is the limit for Robert Reed in a WWE ring. So proud of all of his accomplishments. Why wouldn't he be? Byron, if you ever accomplished anything in your life, you'd understand. I accomplished a thing or two. It's so important to come into this match with a strategy because you must incapacitate your opponent to the point where you can set up the ladder, climb it, and grab the title. The champion's the one who needs a strategy since there are no countouts in this qualification. That means the champion's advantage goes right out the window. And remember, there are no pinfalls the best bet is to render an opponent's leg immobile so they cannot climb the ladder. You need to spend as much time following your opponent as you do going after the championship. Beat it right back to the reversal. Tom's fist connects. Oh, the reversal by Arch. Power bomb. Drop down. Fisherman suplex. This is right forward. Corey, can you even attempt to suggest an actual strategy or game plan in a ladder match? Of course, Corey. Yeah. <laughs> 
legs have swung in multiple directions. It's anyone's guess how this one's going to end. I don't know. Climbing the ladder at this point seems to be a bit ambitious. It's never too early to try. You never know. guys gave everyone their money's worth. Here's another look. Here are your winners. Drew McIntyre and Dolph Ziggler. They outlasted the opposition, climbed every rung, grabbed the prize, and earned their spot in history with this ladder match victory. Definitely a cause for celebration. What an impressive victory.